Okay, once again, down here chilling for a minute. Big ass snook. Like that one probably was over slot. And that, that some bitch needs to be caught. Probably gone by now because I had to run up, had my rod in my room, and grab the GoPro and stuff. I mean, the GoPro is in my room, so I figured, why not? Probably gone now, though. As you can see, uh, I bought the. Might try some freshwater stuff again. Haven't bought any of the lures anyone suggested, which I appreciate, and we'll go check some of those out. But I did get those bent hooks that are for the worm or whatever. Damn, this one's greenish. I do like, I have like, these are one of those Yazeri pens minnows or whatever. Which I probably will only use these because I don't like the new ones they've made for the bigger ones like that big. I don't think they look that great. But this one is old faithful lure for me. Okay, the mullet there. Where did the snook go? He was just like chilling, like right there. I, I just saw some big shadow and I was like, what the hell is that? And then I, I look closer and you could see a big line down its side. Hopefully a wind isn't blowing straight into the microphone. I'm sure it is. Where'd it go? Damn, look at that mullet. That, that looks like a catfish, but it's a mullet. Hopefully the camera picks that up. Oh, he might he might jump. That's probably why that snuck's back here. But I'm actually really excited because that's the biggest fish. The biggest fish I've seen back here. So I mean it was just only one fish, but that means big fish can be around y'all. I like almost always have this rod rigged up with a shrimp or this Yozuri lure. I'm pretty sure if I do hook this snook somehow, probably screwed. <laughs> I can't remember if this is 20 or 30 pound per hour. Bro. I think it was the 20, but I don't really have that much space to work with. Cause there's docks everywhere. I probably also like scared him away cause I like ran up the dock. But he was like aimed this way. Okay, there's the mullet. Those are big mullet, like what the hell? So far I haven't really caught anything on this. I think the black one I did cause the wire's a lot darker here. At my old house, this is like my favorite color lure to use, but that's because high tide we'd get clear water. So the baits would be similar color, but around here, I'm pretty sure. Since we have coffee water, it would be better to have a black one, but I don't know where it is. Does anyone know what these bubbles are? I, I, I figured it's like turtles or something, but it's always like random bubbles coming up and I can't really see through the water to even tell what the hell it is. The one time I don't have a rod rigged up and ready to go. For the most part, like all my fishing rods and stuff are ready to go. Well, this is annoying because now I know there's a giant snook around here that doesn't want to play with me. I wish that mullet would bite that thing would put up a fight <laughs> look at well, i hope the gopro could pick it up that's like a big damn mullet i haven't really seen any smaller ones that that snook could eat i mean it was a pretty big snook but that has to be like a damn tarpon or a shark to bite that why do i keep casting like that every time i cast over here what the hell almost hit my neighbor's boat that would have been not nice Okay, I know I'm like pretty satisfied that I at least saw a big snook back here. But I'm not. I was for like two minutes. Now I'm over it. Now I want to catch it. 
I do want to go hit up some docks. I might do that. I don't know. It's kind of windy. Like, if my boat was smaller, I don't think it'd be... Like, once again, like, my boat's, like, too big to be doing dock stuff. Especially if it's windy. But we might give it a try, because we can't go offshore. I have no clue what we're doing. Pond Lake things. Apparently, a couple people commented that... Uh, they have fished that lake and they've never caught bass there, but some like other kinds of fish that I have no idea what the hell they are. Which is probably the ones, the one fish I saw that I didn't know what the hell it was. If I did manage to hook and catch that snook, I don't know how the hell I'm gonna get it up. I ain't getting the water with these things. Even though these will be the last all white shoes I will ever buy. It's like way too heartbreaking getting these dirty. Guys, look at the size of that damn mullet. That has to be like a pound. Like the GoPro always makes things look weird and like smaller, but that, that mullet's gotta be like that. <laughs> I gotta figure out like a live streaming setup because I'm pretty sure the Wi-Fi from my house comes out the, I know at my old house that's why I never did that I should have did that I had a bunch of friends telling me I should do that but that was way before you could do it on YouTube and like it's actually Justin TV which was way before Twitch but on like Twitch you could never do it because it has to be like a gaming thing but now they have like let you that would have been so because like I the Wi-Fi would totally work fine on my old house doc which is like literally the number one spot in the world to fish for snook <laughs> and like that would have been awesome but i don't have like a can i don't think i have any of my cameras that'll do like live or something i have to like figure that out look at those mullet they're just huge because like i know you can live stream from your phone that'll <laughs> that'll eat through your data thanks i'm glad the wind started up right when i cast and I'm pretty sure it's not like look at that mullet <laughs> that's the biggest mullet I've ever seen in my life oh didn't go down enough and oh yes, uh, before I remember I, I made a video about the gar That's what I thought that was originally. I was like, is that the gar again? And then I was like, wait, that's a snook. <laughs> uh, have not tried that yet. But maybe I'll hop, I, I, I think I just might hop in the kayak and just like go up and down all these docks looking for, I mean, it's been like two weeks, but maybe it just lives around here. I don't know if I want to upload this because nothing really happened. Maybe I will, maybe I won't, I don't know. Depends. Nice. <laughs> I keep thinking those mullet are like jacks just swimming through. Come on. There was a fish under there, he's gone now. better but yeah that's definitely one thing i regret like not fishing like every day and like recording a video at my old house my old dock because at the time i guess i didn't really think about it i wasn't like well we'll pro we, we might be moving soon and then soon came and i was like oh <laughs> Life lesson, I guess. But this summer I'm planning on fishing a lot more than I have previously, because I want to kill some damn fish. Because we haven't been lately. Anyone else been fishing? You know what, I will upload it. Just because, I guess I won't like make it part of 
the fishing with jupe series thing because nothing exciting is happening but i guess something's happening and i want to see if anyone's been catching any fish i know one night during the summer i'm gonna have to kayak down here because i'm pretty sure a couple of these houses have like uh i mean i've always called them and heard them call be called like snook lights <laughs> That's pretty much what they are, but just like the big ass dock light thing. So I might have to check that out. But I might try the next couple of nights some docks, see if see if we can catch some. See if we can catch some fish. And I guess if you want to see what lures I have, basically all the things everyone said to what the hell happened to this one? Throw that away. Got some of these guys, whatever these are. These are the terror eyes, scramps like those caught we've caught a few snuck on these around here i think big which is what i want i don't know what the hell this is doing this is actually a jig i made i should make a video like that i haven't done it in years people will be interested in seeing that it's actually really easy to make your own jigs it's pretty fun this is actually i made a few like this and it caught like dolphin on them it's pretty cool Little scramps. These I like had forever and I've never really used them. I also have like mini tear eyes also. But yeah, mostly stuff people just told me they thought, whatever the hell this is now. I gotta really figure out. I think I had this rigged correctly, but it was because I've tried rigging it so many times it kind of messed up. But that's like one of those weird hooks. I don't know. I don't know. All right, so nothing happened. Um, guess I'll upload it. What the hell is that counting? There's something on my GoPro like counting down. Does that mean it's gonna be like blow up? What the? I've never seen that before. Okay, might have to look that up. Uh, yes, if anyone caught anything, so let me know. Uh, as always, hopefully you guys enjoyed me talking. It's been 22 minutes. Okay. Uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed me talking, and as always, thanks for watching, and hopefully you enjoyed.